Hey, Phil. How's it going? Hey, Tony! How you doing? This bitch is locked! I swear you should lay off that boom shine, man. It smells like paint stripper. It's make my eyes burn. Shh, 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 Tommy. Hey, come over here because there's something I want to show you. Something. Oof, God, should I be able to smell that from way over here? Like Don't boom. you worry about the smell, oh. Tommy. You just watch this. Shitty, cheap, bad bitch or something. There's some more on the bench. Ta-da! Oh, damn! <laughs> Legal review will still run, but now back to the pressing issues. Actually, before we let you get back to the show, I'd like to say something. I know that public radio may not seem very important in an era of poverty and fat. Watch out! Charlie the tree light! I can assure you it is. And not just because I say so. Look at the facts. Fifteen of the last 37 American presidents and 47 vice presidents have appeared on BCPR. No. Radio. Without public radio, we would never have discovered gravity, or the pizza, or the fact that a lot of people love to hear themselves rattle. Anyway, sermon over. I hope you folks at home understand. Focus spirits. Come out of here. The fact I got kicked off the networks. That was very moving, Jonathan. Back to pressing issues. At the hospital, man. Too many cops to be a con. There's an ex-army surgeon who owes me a few things. And a lot He's got a place down, little event. Oh, giant fish. Giants. Not James or Chabis. This isn't a game show. Run, run. Run, run, run. Social debate on free radio without adverts. And I'm still Maurice Chavez. Hi. Next up on pressing issues, we tackle one of the most important The issue of perception. Not credit card fraud. That's deception. But we're talking about perception. How we perceive the world. These are optimistic times we're living in. A time of go-getters and doers. Now personally, some days I wake up 